so what is up guys it's turn of face here welcome back to another tutorial video today is not going to be a glitch video but it's going to be using glitch now the glitch in this video which is this glitch um is shown in my other videos so yeah if you want to know how to do this amazing glitch well check out my other videos but today we're going to be testing DPS test on this. We're going to be testing it on multi targets and yeah, stuff like that. So, let's get right into it. So, uh, first test, let's see. Well, by the way, if you guys didn't know, you can, if you have two things blinded or three, it doesn't really matter, you can go like this. You can dual wield, basically. And if you do that with this and this, you could do it with any sword. It kind of looks insane. But you just gotta, if you press the D-pad quick, it doesn't really look cool. You gotta press them all at the same time. And if you're good enough, you can press all three like this. It's not that hard to press all three. But yeah, you can press all three <laughs> like that. But, okay. Yamir versus Golem. Well, first of all, let's do DPS test. Okay, normally it is about 3,500, And uh, this is my gear, by the way. Uh, I could probably remove this with that, a short arm with that, and then a Venger with that, and I'll have a lot more DPS. Oh yes, 4,000, and this is a uh, ruthless manner, and I can show you a tutorial how to get some shield and gender out in the future. But, okay, test, so it's four to 5,000, I think. Well, now with this new setup on. No, it's 4,000, like, 100 to 200. Okay, now if we'll use the glitch. Ooh. What? It's not blowing up his damage? Is it really? Um, oh, yeah, there we go. It's bumping up to 5,000. Now, if we test it like this. It's really good. And if we test it like this, really good. Now, what you all been waiting to see the golem test. So, I'm gonna spawn the golem in and go. Oh, this is really insane. Let me get some sword hits too. That was basically like a speed kill with me. I'm here. If you see the difference, one, two, three, versus just spamming it. Really cool how you could just spam it like that. But let's go test this on. Uh, which one? Let's go test this on these guys. Oh, geez. So, if you guys didn't know, these projectiles could hit five target of it seems like. But with the trident glitch, it can pierce so long, it can pierce up to six and seven. Maybe even eight. That's why it's so good. So, first of all. Ooh. Yes. This is actually really good. 24,000 DPS right now. So, try and glitch. Ooh. Hitting into 30s to 40,000s. Dang. This is probably better than Solar Eruption, to be honest. Probably. <laughs>
Okay, that's a lot. Okay, um, uh, let's see what else weapons we can try this on. Maybe Influx Wafer. Okay, see. Normal, it's actually doing really, really good. Oh, what, that's a weird bug. That's a weird. Hmm, uh, 2000s and somewhere. How about this? Oh my god. Influx Waiver up to 4,000 DPS. Five, four to 5,000. And guys, this is without it hitting back. It has a chance to hit back twice. This is without that. So, oh, this is a great weapon on Golem. Because this hitbox is so big, so it... <laughs> ah! Wait, guys, I want to tell something. This is going to be great if this works. So I'm going to go up in the sky, and I'm going to do this and go back down. Oh! I just hit, like, 11,000. 11,000 DPS right there. This is insane. Well, let's test it on multi-targets. Multi-targets should be really good for this test, actually. See, normally, hmm, eight, nine thousand, and now it could barely even pierce. But now, eight, nine thousand to ninety, ten thousand. It definitely changes the damage in these weapons, and I really recommend you try this glitch. Really fantastic glitch for anything you're using in general. Hmm. Let's see, any other swords we could test this on? Let's see, a weapon chest. Vampire knives. Classic. Vampire knives. Ooh, this is this is how it looks if you guys haven't seen it yet. What? Oh, DPS test. I was about to test on Golem. Ooh, that's actually really good. Okay, now this. Oh, dang. 2,500, I'm not even taking damage. Wait, if I... So I'm going to take a little bit of damage, right? And then I'm going to use the glitch. Oh, this heals you up near instantly. Well, let me take off some of my armor. And then I want to... I really want to try this glitch. This is, this is amazing. I really recommend this with Vampire Knives. This is not even prefix, by the way. If it was prefix, it would definitely be way better. Unfortunately, <laughs> I really want to try it on this. I'm not going to do it because it'll take so dang long, but <laughs> this is how to trick your
this is whatever, and that's whatever. <laughs> but still, that's insane. Wait. Look like this. I don't even have magic power potions either. <sighs> I might test this versus all bosses in the next video. Because that's going to be lovely and insane. But. Oh, I'm probably going to be signing off right now. Um, hope you guys had a great day. Uh, peace. Hope to see you guys in my next video. Please consider subscribing and comment what you want to see next. Peace.